Hi everyone, thanks for tuning in. This is a review of all my Origins um, products. Um, I have the Origins um, Modern Friction. And it says in the description, or here too, Nature's Gentle Dermabrasion. Exfoliating part of this is actually like tiny rice, like hardened or uncooked rice. I don't know if they're cooked, but it's just like rice. Rice, and you know, instead of like the exfoliating beads you find in most products, this is, they use rice in this. Origins is like, um, kind of a hippie company, kind of, like they, they use all natural stuff and, um, everything they do is like just like old like you know I don't know I don't know how to say it and this stuff I don't use that often because I hate the smell it smells really bad it smells like chemicals and usually Origins have like good smelling products like all their lip glosses smell like peppermint so I'm surprised like this smells so bad Oh, I can't stand it. <laughs> and the description it says two to three times a week scoop on the fingertips and massage over dry skin in circular motions. Add a splash of water and work into gentle lather. Rinse well. But I don't know, this is definitely a myth for origins. It sucks. No. And my skin doesn't like it that much either. Like after I use it my skin is like it looks like it's in pain. I mean, it doesn't hurt when I use it, but it makes, oh, my skin doesn't look that good after using it. Now, this product, I really, really like. No, I love this product, actually. It's the Origin Clear Improvement Active Charcoal Mask Clear Pores. Um, the it's really strong. But this product, she told me, oh, I'll only use this once a week. But... Actually, this stuff is really gentle. Um, my skin isn't red after using it or anything. It's really gentle on my skin. And it does clear my pores. Problem is, like, it clears my pores, but afterwards, you can see my little, not little, but you can see the pores. That's the thing. It doesn't minimize pores. And Origins is not affordable by any means, just to warn you, but I do recommend this. I think this is, like, 25 to 30 dollars, I could be wrong. I also have two, and I don't know why I have two. I don't know how this happened, but I have two of their sharpeners. Virgin's Eye Doctor. Supposed to be for the eye. Um, moisture care for skin around eyes. But, um, and it says it's for AM and PM also. It was too moisturizing for my eyes, and it stung my eyes which is ridiculous considering how expensive this was. So what I do now is since it's so moisturizing, I use it on my face. I use it on my face. And for such a little bottle to be so expensive, it's ridiculous that it hurts my eyes. It really is. I don't suggest you buy this. Um, but I just because I already have it, I use it on my face at night. I'm weird at all. It, I, I don't know how else to describe it. Like a musty lemon. It's like citrus, but not good citrus, like not wonderful I don't know, forget it, I don't know how to explain it. And then I also have Origin Make a Difference, um, Skin Rejuvenating Treatment, and it could be used on AM or PM, um, this I do like the smell of, it's um, citrusy, and sweet, oh shoot, sweet at the same time. Um, there's the, there's a lip tea at it. I'm doing mascaras that you may have seen in previous videos. Lash primer, it's very good. I use it whenever I, uh, under, under all my mascaras. You can mix and match, it doesn't matter, it's gonna work. Jim's Full Story Lush Lash Mascara in La Total Black. 
this was in a gift set. That's why it's like so tiny, but you know, I'm pretty sure it comes in a full size. This I um, mascara is very good for separating and lengthening your lashes, but it's not great at volumizing. It is a product that I am loving right now. I put it on at night. It says um, a perfect world white tea skin guardian and you can use it AM or PM also and the it's good because it's a pump so it doesn't get um, contaminated. When I use this at night and then I wake up in the morning my skin is so soft and rehydrated and the thing is it goes on in a it's a gel um, so when it goes on it's not too slippery like a lotion it absorbs quickly into the skin and I got this in uh, a gift set with this the microdermabrasion or modern friction sorry they came together but once I run out of this I will definitely buy more um, my original lip lip product these in the tubes, these lip glosses, I don't like them. Um, look what happened, for example, in this one. The brush actually fell in the tube. And I don't know exactly how to fix it, because this is a really nice color. Um, number 15, Sheer Passion. Um, Origins Once Upon a Shine. Okay. Um, very nice color. It's just sad that, you know, the packaging sucks. And the other thing I don't like about this packaging is um, when you pull out the, you know, the, the wand and then come to put it back in when you close it, what happens a lot of the time is the gloss will come out on the side. Oh, I don't have a napkin. And what I would do is I would have to take a napkin and wipe it. So you lose a lot of product that way. It's unfortunate because these are expensive. So so this color is Once Upon a Shine in Sheer Shimmer, number 17, on um, what's in the box, because um, <laughs> I freaking, you know, it's the, the tip is red, because I put it on top of my lip gloss, so, okay, don't pay attention to the first one, because that's not true to color, um, the wand is just pink, this is more, I don't know what it looks like, the second swatch, shimmer in it. Um, yeah. I can't swatch this one because the two tones, the one, so. The Sheer Candy. Sheer Candy. Third one down. And it's like kind of a cotton candy pink. Like a soft pink. And the Origins Liquid Lip Color. And this is in, um, Number 16, Juicy Details. Don't you love that name? I love it when they give fun names to products. Down, that is Juicy Details. Um, a coral color, a pink coral color. The shimmer is very strong. So what I like to do is, I. this is the only one I would wear by itself. But the optic is a little too dark, it will tone it down. It helps to tone it down. Um, this color is good for that, um, sheer shimmer, that's why the tip of this brush is red, because I do use it on lip glosses, or, I mean, lipsticks that are dark, too dark, out of all the lip glosses, because this is the most, um, versatile color. You can put it on top of a lipstick, or you can wear it by itself, it's a very nice color. I do have, I would say, you, um, go out and get this, it's worth the money. Um, clear Improvement by Origin. It's a, it's a mask. Just put it on and then, uh, or you could steam your face and then put this on, let it dry, and then just wash it off. Well, thanks for watching. I hope this is helpful, you guys. I hope I schooled you in Origin's products just a little bit. Um, thanks for watching. Bye.